Alright, so it's about 1.30 in the morning. We are about halfway between Great Sale and pretty much West End. And pretty calm. Not a lot of wind. Pretty flat water. It was clear skies before. You could see so many stars out there. Now the moon's out. It's a really bright moon. And we're getting a little more cloud coverage. So less stars, but... I'm fighting to stay awake here. Sierra's taking a nap. So far, so good. We're on our way. Good morning, guys. It's 6 a.m. We have West End in the background over there. We're a few miles offshore now. Heading out. It's not super flat. Definitely got a little bit of a swell. Forecast says two to three feet. So far, that's about right. We put some limes off the back. Hopefully, we catch a fish on our way. And I think we're gonna put Sierra on watch. I'm gonna take a little nap because I was up all night. Here we go. Wish us luck. And I'd say we're almost halfway. It's actually pretty calm out. It's a really nice day. So we're going to attempt to make breakfast burritos for breakfast. Here we go. Some clouds and a, a water spout forming off to the side here. I'll show you guys if you get too close, you won't be able to see it. Got a fish. Either a tuna or a little bonita. Yeah, a small dolphin, huh? Should we keep it in the water or not? Look, we caught a dolphin. Jetty spotted him right away. Good job, Jetty. High five. High five. We got fish number two on. Billy's fighting it. Hey, it feels pretty strong. Another dolphin? There's a couple, there's another behind it. He's pretty big. Oh no, oh no, oh no. He went under, he went under. Should I get the gas? Yeah, get the gas, actually. That was off. All right, we got dolphin number two. This guy, he's pretty big. Sierra's got another one even bigger on, I think. Woo -hoo -hoo. Yeah. What? I'm going in forward, is that all right? All right. No! Oh! <laughs> oh, what happened? The line broke? Oh, man. That was so freaking exciting. Sierra got hers. It, hers was huge, bigger than the, this one we landed. Oh, she got hers all the way to the boat, and the thing jumped and just the line chafed and broke. Oh, right at the hook. Look at these cool little things that, that came out of the dolphin mouth that they're eating. I don't know what they are. They look like mini like little puffer fish or something. Something We're almost back. We're about 15 miles from the Florida coast. It definitely got a little bit rougher than it was in the beginning of our crossing. But just starting to lay back down a little bit as we approach the coast of Florida. We got another mahi. So that makes what we get three. Landed three mahi. Making up for the time that we're not fishing in the Bahamas. So that's alright. Hey, having fun? Alright, I think we're getting boarded by the Coast Guard. Coming up in the corner over there. 
There was another sailboat that got boarded back behind us over there. And this is another Coast Guard boat coming straight at us. So we'll probably get a safety check done and make sure. All right, so the Coast Guard boarded us, and they were super cool, super nice, very professional. They would have been in and out in five minutes. They really just wanted to check our IDs and take a look in the bilge. But we were in neutral when they boarded. Or they told us to go in neutral when they boarded, and then our tender was slamming up against the side of the boat because it wasn't being pulled behind us anymore. So I asked if I could put it in forward, and they said yeah, and I put it in forward without checking the line, the painter, and I got the painter wrapped around the prop. <laughs> and it's like, like kind of choppy and windy, I had to dive under the boat and unwrap the, the tender line. So that made it a little longer than it should have been, but it's alright. Wow, look at this rip we're in. Here's another Coast Guard boat coming right, right up next to us. I don't think they're checking us. I think they were probably communicating, but where do you, where are they? There they are. That's the third small Coast Guard boat we saw here. officially back in Florida. Well, maybe not officially. We are on our way to border, custom and border patrol to check back in to make it official. But we're here, physically. We ran that engine for 36 hours straight to get from Green Turtle all the way back to Jupiter. Got a little rough in the middle of the Gulf Stream, got boarded by the Coast Guard for a short check. Got the line wrapped around the prop, caught some nice fish. Pretty, pretty eventful crossing, I'd say. It was, everything was smooth up until we got boarded. And then everything went haywire. In here, we've been here before. Check in for uh, border and protection, customs. Okay. Private yes. vessel, okay. All right, you gotta go to the guy in the red shirt. He will tell you where to park. I think it's the second floor. Farla. Farla. Cruise, or get, hopefully not getting off. From yesterday about... Yeah, what time was it? About 5 o'clock? Um, yeah, what about 5? 4 okay, maybe? Okay. And what was the name of this vessel? Neverland? Yeah. We're all good? Yeah, yeah. I'm good. That's all good like Thank you very much. Yeah. Alright guys, just because our adventure in the Bahamas is over doesn't mean our adventure is over. We're actually traveling up the east coast of the US right now as we speak, as I'm editing this video. And we're going all the way up to Long Island, New York. We're gonna take a whole month to do it. So we have a lot of exciting things planned, things to see, things to do as we head up there and while we're up in Long Island as well. I lifeguard up there in the summer and Sierra's gonna lifeguard this year as well. Stay tuned with us. We have a lot more stuff coming. We'll try to post. I've been posting every other day or every third day and I'm gonna try and stay pretty consistent with that. You can also check out Jetty has a vlog now. So I'll put her vlog in the description below. Definitely check out Jetty's vlog. All right, something else I want to talk to you guys about real quick. A lot of you guys have been asking in the comments how you can kind of support our videos, how you can help out. We really appreciate that. We make these for fun. We do it for you guys. We do it for us. We, we just like to do it. We like to record our experiences and share. If you want to help out, some simple things you can do are just giving a thumbs up when you see our videos. There's a little thumb, there's a thumbs up and a thumbs down. So to give a little thumbs up every time you see our videos and you like it. If you give us a comment below, that helps a lot. Make sure you're subscribed 
below so that you get notified when we post new videos. And if you share our videos with your friends, just post a link to our video on your Facebook page or share it with your friends or whoever you think might like our videos as well. Some other ways you can help us out monetarily are we have an Amazon affiliate account, so I'll put a link in the description below. If you click the Amazon affiliate link, it brings you right to Amazon. And then if you just do your normal Amazon shopping, whatever, check out, and then we get a little tiny percentage of what you pay Amazon just as a commission for referring you guys there. And it's absolutely no extra cost to you guys. So that helps us out a lot. So just click the Amazon link below, then bookmark it so that every time you're doing your Amazon shopping, you just click the link on your bookmark or your favorite tabs. It brings you to Amazon. You do your normal Amazon shopping, check out, whatever, and it helps us out a little bit. One more way you guys can support is through Patreon. So I'll put that in the description as well. And you can pledge if you think our videos are worth a dollar a video, five dollars a video, ten dollars a video. Whatever you think, you can pledge to, to that. So whatever you guys think, you know, we're going to make these videos anyway. We hope you guys like them. We've gotten a ton of positive comments and positive engagement, so we're going to keep doing it. And if you guys want to help out, that's great. If not, no problem. We're going to do it anyway. Well, thank you guys for watching, and stay tuned, and we'll see you guys next time.